we've got amazing staff here um, who are really uh, experts in their field, um, ecologists, reserve managers. Um, so from the Gloucestershire wildlife point of view, obviously the first thing is that we have reserves on site um, that people can come to with facilities. We've had a team with Cathy who's been out on the Great Nut Hunt, which is really useful for us and I think Intel have got a lot out of that. They've really learned about um, ecology and are really getting excited about the nut hunt and learning about door mice. Um, we've also had another group who are doing some ride clearance um, with some of our reserve managers and that's brilliant for Lower Woods, who really helps the ecology of the Lower Woods and helps Neil to manage um, the woods here. This is an ancient road that runs right the way through the woods and what we've been doing, we've actually Trying to work our way back to the original woodland bank. So either side of the track, we have a lovely old medieval ditch and bank system, um, and that's just been lost over the years through lack of grazing and lack of mowing. Um, and so, what, what we're doing is working our way back to those original banks, um, taking out some quite substantial trees that have grown up in that time, um, and yeah, and restoring to it to, it, to its original width and uh, the original vista. Because this is also a view to the Hawkesbury Monument as well. So as a du double benefit. To have this many, this amount of manpower on site is fantastic. Um, you know, this, this job we do ourselves, but it would take us so much longer. And this has been absolutely great. You know, you turn your back for a moment and a, a whole other area has been cleared. So I always under underestimate how much they can get done. And this is absolutely fantastic. I, so we've done this uh, twice this year. We did it uh, once in March uh, as well. And I think, uh, I think everybody enjoys it. They, it's a day out of the office um, and you can, you can really tangible results. You can see immediately that the ride is a lot brighter and a lot clearer. So yeah, I think everybody's loved it. And it's really good for uh, team building. Uh, yeah, it's just good to, to get out. It's a completely different thing to do. Um, and yeah, you know, stress levels go away and you, you know, go back refreshed again. So yeah, I think it's great. There's lots of really great evidence that um, you know being actually outside benefits people's health, people's well-being, well-being brings down stress levels. And as I said, people are working in teams and talk to people that they don't normally talk to. The, the teamwork aspect is is very very similar because um, we you know we, we blend well as a group. But it's good to just have a day to, to you know in, enjoy enjoy the countryside and. You know, have fun with the team, so very good. It just is it's really nice to do this. I mean, it does. It's actually, you feel better physically, but um, it's like you've achieved something as well, so yeah, it's a good feeling. And we've got a, we've got a new colleague over here on my team, the guy who's sort of cutting away. But um, it's a very good bonding exercise, sort of like team building exercise. That's the word that I'm looking for. As a, you know, we've never actually worked with him before, so actually having to do this is the first kind of thing. It's it's pretty good.